This is a 10 day old uh, male puppy. Um, I'm thinking of keeping this puppy. Um, his name's Lexus. A beautiful chap, really, really balanced temperament. His eyes have just opened. I don't know if you could see that. They're just opening now. It's amazing because the, the, there's no real focus in their eyes yet. Um, but um, yeah, just really nice, very balanced. I'm sure you've seen clips of, <laughs> of a female bitch, very large, but she's always like, you know, whining. He just seems like nothing phases him at all, you know, just just takes things in his stride. And, um, you know, it's, um, it's very encouraging to see such a balanced uh, temperament at, a, at such a, a young age. Um, he's not the biggest puppy in the world at the moment, um, you know, actually. I'd say he was the uh, second smallest, but it's a balanced litter, um, very, very balanced litter, which you get that when you line breed. This is a line breeding. Um, inbreeding, not such a good idea. Line breeding will give you an absolute type. You can see fantastic head structure there. You know, again, we're talking about puppies that are 10 days old. Um, it, it's really amazing to see these uh, puppies take such form, at such early, st early stages in their lives. Um, they, they show a lot of determination when they're feeding. Um, there's a lot of charisma in their attitude and determination, which for me is a massive survival instinct. Um, you know, it, having a, a puppy that wants to live, that wants to, to do well, um, that is 80% of the battle. Um, you know, the reason, which I've mentioned before, why, you know, canines have such large litters is, you know, the mortality rate is very, very high. And I honestly have to say that, you know, okay, the whelp was pretty difficult because the, the puppies were, were, were quite big, but I am quite sure that, you know, if I wasn't there, I wouldn't, she wouldn't have needed me really, because these puppies were so strong that they would have found her. Um, right throughout the process, I haven't actually needed to do anything at all besides, you know, obviously feed her, um, clip their nails back, and um, I have, haven't had to be putting puppies on teats, which a lot of times you have to do with many breeds. I don't know, you know, it's the second litter that I'm having that are, are strong like this, so I'm still going with a statement that, you know, this breed naturally is an exceptionally hardy breed, and you can see that actually in the offspring. Uh, and their, their development rate as well is insane. Really developing fast. Um, this this um, puppy is starting to recognize me and his eyes are just open. He's actually starting to focus and it's just 10 days old. Big yawn. Oh. <laughs>